puppies. As you can see, there's a little bit of a different view today. I'm on my son's 2008 Sportster Nightster 1200. My 16 year old son who works out at Frontier Harley Davidson, our local Harley shop, he saved up all summer long and he bought this 2008 Harley Davidson 1200 Sportster. Now this is a tank off of a 2000, I don't remember if it's 2000 or 20 or 2018 Sportster and so is the front fender. The rear fender is still black but I mean they match well together. But he's put a lot of uh, heart and soul into this bike. Um, these are the bars off of a, I think, they're off of a street bob. I think they're off of one of the new ones too because it's got the wrinkled black and everything. Um, the only problem <laughs> is that this used to be a mechanics bike. And we all know mechanics can't leave their bikes alone. I'll leave it in fifth gear and I'll roll on it. One thing I do notice, because I just got off of my Road King, um, the wind really, really affects this bike. Not so much the head-on wind. I don't feel that as much, because this fairing actually does quite a bit. It's, uh, it's the wind from the side. Really, really affects it. get off and take a look at it here yeah it's super cool he white lettered the tires he did that himself he wrapped the exhaust we did that in the garage they put the fair the front fairing on it different fender different tank I think that's a different rear fender too but it's you know it's black so but it looks good together because the side covers are black and the oil tank covers are black but I don't know. You guys that know Sportsters maybe know better than me. But, but it really seems like it's got some work done to it. Yeah, it's cool. He did a good job with it. And it's got a little swing arm bag. It's fun to ride. off-roading this is not the best seat in the world but it is for him because he's we let's see if we can make a run a little bit huh Runs plenty good for a 16 year old, that's for sure. Mm, I don't know if I want to. I'm just gonna keep it. I'm just gonna keep it, and I'm gonna make it mine. <laughs> it rides comfortable too. I mean, everything vibrates, you know, it vibrates more than mine. My feet are vibrating, my hands are vibrating, my butt's vibrating, you know. But that's just a sportster, right? I mean, that's what it is. And now I'm not going straight into the wind, so it is more comfortable to ride. The wind doesn't feel like it's trying to lift us both up me and the bike I don't really care for the mirrors underneath the bars like this but it does look better like that but yeah this is a fun bike though man 1200's got plenty of power don't it if I put it in fourth gear they're 60 I don't care for the way the pegs are but I do like these mid controls the way that it sits me on the bike, I prefer this over being stretched out like on the Fury. I wish the Fury had mid controls on it, that would be cool. So everybody, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more Sportster videos, subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And until next time, this will be fun. And until next time, 
stay cool and we will see you on the road.